Meanwhile, we are in the final stretch of summer vacation for students in the mid-state. Teachers are busy preparing now for students to return to class this week for the 2015-16 school year. News Channel 5's Matthew Torres is here in the studio this morning with more. And Matthew, Metro, some Metro students are going to be riding to new buses to school, right? Jennifer, 124 new school buses. The chief operating officer for Metro Schools admits it's a lot, but these new buses are well equipped with upgraded safety features. These new buses will have the first two rows equipped with built-in car uh, seats built in car uh, for pre-K and kindergarteners. So Each bus back. will also have four cameras, two in the front, one in the middle and the fourth in the back. But I think the most interesting one, the future really, check this out, is an alarm system that forces bus drivers to make sure each kid has left the bus before they themselves can leave. He can't open the door or the alarm will go off. So the bus driver has to walk to the back of the bus, checking the seats on both sides to make sure that there are no students asleep um, on the back of the bus. Here's the safety reset button. When I hit that, I should get a double blink on my interior lights. And now you can exit the bus and the alarm will not go off. The chief operating officer also says that the reason why they have such a number of high number of new buses is because this year they got additional funding. Now, as far as bus routes, that will stay the same.